Yo, happy Turn Up Tuesday to you. What's going on, fam? Right now, I'm in the car on my way to work. Running kind of late. Uh, I get a text from one of the people in the newsroom like, hey, where are you at? I'm at home, where I'm supposed to be. Oh, well, well the consultant is here. Pause, let me pause that for a second. Let me tell you about consultants. I think consultants are like hairs on butts. They're there for a reason, but they're annoying as hell. I'm not a fan of consultants, never have been. Uh, I think they they have a job, you know, they they come in and tell you what you should change, what might work. That's cool. But when you start messing with my stuff, that's that's when it's a problem. Like, stick to news, let news know what they need to do. Check out this truck. Um, but yeah, I'm just like, whatever, dude. Are you, what are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? Okay, you're keeping straight? Cool, I'm gonna keep straight too. Anyways, I just hate consultants. There's one here today. And I guess he's here for the next couple days. Whatever. I just, I take it as a grain of salt and just keep, keep it going. But they're annoying as hell. Uh, it's a gorgeous day out and I'm stuck indoors for the next eight hours. <sighs> Happy Tuesday. Turn up. Pitch. Oh. One more. One more. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> yeah. Yes. So they're in the championship already? They're in the National League Championship. Yes. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Failed you again as a vlogger. I've been over like three hours and this is the first time I picked up the camera. So when I got off work, went straight to the store, picked up some uh, chicken thighs and uh, I popped them in the oven. That way I can have that for lunch and dinner tomorrow. But I did that and then I came home and cooked and then I just sat here and played a video game for about an hour, man. I just forgot to crack open the camera. I'm sorry. Um, I'm going through it right now, y'all. Like, I got a lot of stuff on my mental. And uh, I don't know. I'm driving home and, like, I'm playing slow jams and all this stuff. I think I'm just missing Kamisha. But at the same time, 
Um, what we talked about before with the whole South Bend thing and, and going after what you going after what you want and being happy has also been like resonating in my head too. So the kids just been thinking a lot, man, and I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. But you know, you only can take it one day at a time. I'm not trying to be um depressed, I'm not trying to be anxious or anything. Um it's just stuff that I've been thinking about, man, and it's really starting to, you know, become prevalent in what I'm thinking about. If that's the right word that I need to use, I don't know. It's just a lot going on, man. I really, um, Sunday, well, me and Ma, Ma gets in Saturday. I keep talking about it, but Ma gets in Saturday. Um, if I don't wake up, I will wake up on time. I really want to go check out a church, so that might be the best opportunity for me to go check out a church when she's here. But I just, I don't know. I got this feeling. I got this feeling that I just can't turn it loose. Okay, sorry. Um, but there's something missing, and I know what it is. Um, you know, and it's it's church. It really is church. Like, in South Bend, I have my church fam. In Vegas, I have my church fam. Even in Jonesboro, I have my church fam. Um, here, not so much. And part of the problem is... Oh, oh. Waiver request. Processed. Processed. That's what I'm talking about. Problem is, when I was in Jonesboro, I went to church with Rena, and then I started going to church with Kamisha. Uh, in Vegas, of course, mom and dad and Rena were there. And even in South Bend, I went because I knew the pastor because I have already I had already talked to him. Here, I don't know nobody. I don't know nobody at the churches or anything like that. So it kind of like kind of makes me nervous to go check out a church. Like I went and checked out a church with my friend Ann one day, but it wasn't a church that I was used to. It's kind of different. It was a primary. It was a predominantly white church. Um, and it just wasn't, you know, the message was great, but it just, the church just felt weird. And I don't know if anybody else has ever felt that before, but, um, I don't know. There's a couple other churches I want to check out, but I, just going by myself, is it's just kind of weird. And it's weird talking about this right now. I want you to know that, like, talking to you guys about this right now, I could feel like a weight coming off my shoulders, man. It's, it's weird. But... I know that's what the problem is. I really do need to get into a church and get involved in a church um, because that, that's exactly what's been missing. Um, so that's going to be the next mission. Honestly, I don't know how much longer I'm going to be in Denver. Um, I don't know what the next chapter holds, but um, it's one day at a time, guys. I'm not rushing nothing. I'm not, you know actively looking for a job unless it's something amazing that comes across my table but I really want to start focusing on what I want to do and I really want to uh, be somewhere where I'm going to be happy if that makes any sense to y'all leave a thumbs up comment down below let me know what you guys think man um, but it is 1 20 in the morning I'm going to bed because we gotta get up and go to work in the morning and it's hump day so we're halfway through the week already um, like I said, during the week, guys, I'm sorry that the vlogs aren't, you know, as action-packed as they normally, you know, as they are on the weekends. But when you work, 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 that's what happens, man. So, uh, but like I said before, weekend, when the weekend gets here, me and mom should be doing a lot. And I'm excited for her to be here, man. I really am. But until tomorrow morning, I love each and every one of y'all. I want you guys to have a blessed evening, blessed day. Go hug somebody. Tell them that you love them two fingers in the air. Peace. And we'll talk tomorrow because it's hump day.